What is up guys, Shiba here with Wally Jack, and today we're going to be playing a new game. Nope, hold on, it's not new. Okay. What is up guys, Shiba here with Wally Jack, and today we're going to be playing this game I found on the internet called Presentable Liberty. Now this is a free indie game that has recently been kind of making its way around YouTube. It's, it is a bit of an older game, and before I actually get into the video, uh, it does warn that talks about um, the subject of suicide and depression a little bit. Um, I have no idea what happens in this game. Um, I just... Um, I saw a YouTuber start, he started to play it, and I decided, you know what, this actually might be cool to play, and this was like three months ago or so, so I decided to play it for myself. Also, this video will probably be about an hour long, and I'm going to do it in one playthrough, so let's go ahead and go. Day one. What we got here? Whoa, okay, interesting. So yeah, this game is the game that I was talking about, and Emily is a way that is somewhat similar in some ways, because... Um, how it works is you have notes and stuff that'll come through this little slat right here and you're supposed to read it and things will happen in your room uh, it'll go night and day it's currently 12 20 and we have wires sticking out over here I wonder what's gonna happen so um the game it doesn't it isn't like super duper uh, like pretty I guess whoa okay uh, press the left mouse button to open the letter under the door all right so like I said, the game doesn't look too amazing, but it is a pretty cool game based on like reviews and stuff I've read. Alright. <clears throat> My dear friend, I hope this letter finds you well. How is prison going? I know it must be hard, especially in times like these. As for me, I will not I will soon start another one of my journeys into the unknown. Wishing me luck. Salvador the Traveler. Alright, cool. So I'm guessing he's my friend. I don't know <laughs> anything about this actually. Also something I just kinda realized that this this uh this kind of fits the screen kinda weird. Uh, friend, I hope you aren't feeling too lonely in the dark cell. It's not very dark. <laughs> Just in case, I have put a, I have put a little bug friend for you in the envelope alongside the letter. <laughs> like a little spider. Well, like I was saying, uh, this, the game doesn't actually fit my screen. I'm actually recording it in a window, which is kind of weird because I normally record stuff full screen. So, if there's like black bars on the left, right, and maybe even top and bottom, I am kind of sorry about that, guys. All right, see, oh, this is different. Good day. We are happy to inform you that you have been selected by me, Dr. Money, to join an in to join an exclusive program for inmates all over the country. Alrighty. We have noticed that due to the recent outbreak of a terrible virus, the, pro the population of our beautiful nation has started dwindling. This is unfortunate, but there is still hope. You. Oh gosh. This is going to be one of these games? Recent studies show that 90% of our great nation's population is already infected with the virus. Incidentally, many of the remaining 2% are prison inmates like you. We hope that you continue to be vigilant and remain healthy. I will try my best. <laughs> in order to fight depression and suicidal thoughts in the in the dire situation you have found yourself in, you will be assigned your own personal happy buddy trademark. Enjoy. What? I thought there was going to be like someone in the room or something. That would be weird. Hello, hello, hello. <clears throat> I'm, your, I'm your own personal happy buddy. I have a present for you. Five confetti poppers. Have fun. Whoa, okay. Uh, you... Press the right, press the right mouse button. You use items. All right, one, two. Okay, I only have one. Should we use one already? Yeah. Uh, let's see, we'll, we'll get right. We'll get right here. What is? What does this look like? <laughs> it's kind of cute, honestly. It just like slowly falls to the ground. Oh, hold on, hold on. I know there's a letter there. We need to come up with a name for this guy. Um, let's call him Timmy. I like the name Timmy. He just looks like a Timmy, I guess. Hello, my buddy friend, buddy. God, okay, that's weird. Did you enjoy the confetti? If so, I have another present for you. Oh, what is it? It's a Dr. Money portable entertainment machine. Game included. Have lots of fun. Ooh. Right click. Oh, yeah. Uh, to put it away. Okay, uh. Serpent. WASD to select what? Oh, okay. It's like a snake, kind of. Ooh, interesting. Okay, so it's kind of like a Game Boy in some way. Alright, uh, what is this? Uh, my dear friend, I've started my journey in the Far East with no clear goal in mind. Alright, so you're just like wandering around <laughs> in the East. Alright. <laughs> On the road, I met a nice woman who gave me directions to the nearest lake. You know how much I like swimming. Apparently I do. I know you very well, even though I don't. Alright, uh, let's get this thing. This thing, if I go. Oh, there's 20 levels. Okay, interesting. This is a lot like Snake. I have a feeling some of you are kind of too young to even know what that is. Ooh, let's see what this says. Look, 
Friend, the lake is beautiful. It is so peaceful and quiet here. Have you ever been so alone that you cannot convince yourself of the fact that other people exist anymore? Okay, that's not a good question to ask somebody that's in prison or jail. I honestly don't know much of a difference other than prison is apparently worse and that you're there longer. Uh, this is okay, it's from Sal again. Friend, I have a present for you. It's a painting that always reminds me of the spirit of travel. I hope it will liven up your cell a little bit. Where is it? <gasps> Ooh. <laughs> you know what that looks like? It looks like the old uh, Windows background. Like from, uh, uh, what was it? It was like Windows Vista or XP. <laughs> it's kind of cool. It's awesome. Let's see what this is. This is my happy buddy. Hey, buddy. How are you doing? How are you? Do yeah. <laughs> Sorry about that. Uh, if you're feeling down, maybe a song will help. Uh, singing. Wait. Happy to be alive. Look at that. Take out the la la and glad. Happy glad to be alive. I don't know. This happy buddy guy it seems kind of awkward. We're Jimmy go. No, I'm sorry, not Jimmy, Timmy. I don't want to forget your name. You have like one little eyeball. If you were, if this is real life, I probably wouldn't like you because I don't like bugs. <laughs> that was fun, wasn't it? Hope you keep a song in heart always, for you are kind and important and c smart. The way I read that letter didn't seem like it. I like skipped the last word and went down the line. Jeez. Okay, what do we got outside? There's a door. This doesn't look like a prison. Like, I don't know, it probably is, I'm guessing. There's like a red light. There's a white door, though. Like, that's not the kind of door you would see in a prison. It'd be like a door with, like, bars or something like this one. Ooh, good day, Mr. Smiley. We have noticed that you have not met your our happiness quota yet. Remember, you'll only get to see your daughters again if you manage to lower the suicide rates in the prison. Who the heck is Mr. Smiley? Is he talking to me? Dear... Okay, blank. <laughs> We have accidentally sent you a letter addressed to a certain Mr. Smiley. We want you to know that this mistake has been rectified and that your happy buddy really does like you and is your best friend. Purely because you are so friendly. How are you doing? See, this already has like a weird tone under it. <laughs> I'm feeling so great. Uh, you are my best, friendliest, happy friend in the world. The whole wide world. Okay, I honestly am not sure how I feel about the happy buddies yet. If my calculations are correct, then this letter will arrive at your cell around not bedtime, yeah. I hope those prison beds are comfortable. I don't know. I've never slept on one. It honestly looks like a little skinny mattress with a little skinny pillow. I don't I don't think mattresses are like that. Wow, it is dark. What time is it? It's not is it like winter time I'm guessing? Because press space to go to bed. Ooh. <laughs> you can see that I have Timmy. Alright, let's let's go to bed. Alright, day two. Gosh, that scared me a little bit. I don't know why. Just my volume's kind of loud. I always edit it down a little bit for you guys. Ooh, what is this? Rise and shine, sleepy head. I hope you had a good night's sleep. I sure did. Hooray. Uh, to celebrate the occasion of you getting up, I have sent you a second game for your portable entertainment product. Also known as the PEP. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> Ooh, fear of fire. W-A-S-D. Oh, we get to play as little Timmy. Oh no, I can see what's going to happen. This is going to get difficult eventually. Okay, so I, th I, s I have to survive for 10 seconds in this. It's already twice as hard, because, well, no, it's a little bit harder. Not very, though. I honestly kind of like games like this, like, that aren't extremely hard, but considering there's 20 levels and it's already doubled the number of little fireballs, it's kind of worrying me about what level 20 is going to look like. Alright, I'll read that in just a second, guys. Let's see here. Got me and Timmy. I'm gonna be good. Yeah, me. come on, Timmy, don't die on me. Alright, what's up at level 5? Fuck the sound effects. Um, friend, I've decided to head north, which is, as you know, my favorite corner direction to head. Okay, bit nerdy. <laughs> on the way, I pass my I pass by a very interesting river. A sign, a sign next to it said that the water changes the direction it is flowing in around this time of year. Ooh, that's interesting. Is that possible? Fascinating, wouldn't you say? Yeah, I would. That's interesting. I, I didn't. I don't even think that's possible. Maybe it is. I don't know. I must stay here and witness the change occurring. My, curi my curiosity is just too tremendous to resist the temptation. As much as I enjoy vast landscapes and new locations to explore, sometimes in life one must appreciate the little things. Sal, I agree. I have another present for you. It's a poster to remind you always to be, always to keep a smile on your face. Oh, is it gonna be like another painting? Okay. Um, let's see. I have a feeling it's gonna be like. 
Okay, smiley face is what I'm gonna guess. Or... Why? Why does it look like, look like it? <laughs> Why does it look like it has blood on it? Why would that remind you to keep happy? That's just creepy looking. Did they add anything else? No. Got me and Timmy confetti on the floor. Ooh, this is a new person. Good day. I don't think you know me, but from what I've heard, it seems that you and I are the last people in this town who are still not infected with the virus. Oh, jeez. Okay. Uh, I'm the owner of a pastry shop not far from where your cell is. But as I don't want to get infected, I cannot sell my pastries to anyone anymore except you. I would really appreciate it if you could come visit me sometime and maybe have a cup of tea. One thing I can't really read is, like, handwriting very well. Like, okay, there's, like, certain handwriting I can read, but there's some, uh, phew, no. Alright, see here. Let's mess around with this again. I like this. This is definitely probably one of the games I'll be playing more often. But it looks like there's, like, up to five games in the space it has available. Alright, see here. Let's do one more after this. Oh yeah, level six already. Doctor Money's P E P or Pep. All right, there we go. Wow, okay, that was a lot of fireballs. All right. By the way, my name is Charlotte. Nice to meet you. Aw, oh, nice to meet you too, Charlotte. I have a feeling that Timmy probably wants to meet Charlotte too, don't you? Yeah. So while we're sitting here, I have a little bit of something I want to talk to you guys about, and that actually has to do with my new computer that I'm going to be getting here real soon. Um, within a week or so of this video going up, I'm going to be getting my new desktop, and I'll be leaving a link down below to the computer and a couple of the customizations I'm going to add. Oh wow, okay, there's blue things now. So, like, the new computer I'm getting is so much better than this one. Like, I'm going to be able to, there really isn't much of a limit of stuff I can record on that one. Okay, this is getting pretty hectic, and we're only, we're not even at level 10 yet. Just in case you're curious, the computer is made by uh, Ironside. Okay, wow. That was a lot of fireballs. My dearest companion, the river's change in direction was quite interesting to see. This is exactly what I love about my travels. You always get to see new and amazing things. I agree. You know, <laughs> me being like for someone that does YouTube and that doesn't go outside very often, I agree that nature is pretty cool. Not to mention, like, I honestly would, I, I would rather see like a picture of nature instead of like a picture of like some cool architect or something even though like cool like buildings and stuff are awesome and all um I don't know why it's just like one of those things that are soothing and then there's this you just don't want to look at that that's the only thing I can say alright let's, let's sit over here so we can have like a good little view of our uh no we gotta get a good view good little view of our picture yeah there we go alright uh fear of fire oh gosh alright so there's now five blues Real hope it is, doesn't add a bunch of blues. Oh my gosh, now there's six. This is gonna be crazy, guys. This little mini game, I guess you could call it. Ooh, we're doing good. Man, ten seconds is gonna end up being a long time. I can feel it already. Oh, that was my first death. Darn. I got cornered by two blues. God dang it, that was just a stupid uh, accident. Oh, I got another one. Right. Crap! Okay, that's from Charlotte again. I'm very sorry if I came off as eager, as too eager in my fast, in my last letters to you. No, you seemed alright. <laughs> Fact is, I haven't really had much contact with people anymore lately. Yeah, me neither. It's kind of like a prison life. You don't get to talk to very many people. <laughs> Please forgive me if I made you feel uncomfortable. No, you were good. I honestly kind of wish that I could talk to the, like, right back to the people. You know, that'd be kind of cool. Alright, um, let's see here. Uh, I'll probably play Fear of Fire and try to get to at least 15 if I can. <laughs> I love how I said that and I died within like 3 seconds. Okay. See, see, like, because of this, you have to, like, look around everywhere. Oh, come on, I did not hit that. Alright. Uh, God dang it. Okay, down. Man, really? Just, like, all of a sudden, I'm doing horrible. No. <laughs> Gosh. Level 12 and I've, d I've died probably like five times at least by now. Alright, there we go. Oh god, another seven blues. Alright. It's getting kind of crazy on this little mini screen of mine. Just curious, how many guys have ever had a Game Boy? 
So that's what I said this thing is similar to, in some ways. Alright, let's see what this is. Uh, I used to have a Game Boy. They were pretty cool. I had the one that you like opened up, like not the flat screen, but like the hinged ones, I guess you could say. Hello, I'm having... No, sorry. I hope you're enjoying your two games. I am. Uh, they were expensive, you know. Really? No, see, this, they definitely won't be expensive. This thing is free. I don't know. I'm scared to know what a free game looks like in this game. Alright. Oh, there's a big orange dude. Do you see that? Oh, whoa. Hey, he shoots little fireballs. Ugh. The struggle. <laughs> okay, that was just a mistake of mine. Jeez. Okay, when you get to like corners and stuff, kinda. Don't wanna get. Uh, don't wanna get yourself trapped in a corner. Oh yes. All right. Fifteen. I definitely don't see myself making it past twenty. Gosh dang it. Gosh dang. It. Uh, all right. I was about to get killed anyway. All right. Uh, ha ha ha. Please don't be sad. Okay. I don't know, man. There's just something off about this Mr. Not Mr. Happy. Uh, Happy Buddy. I don't know. Alright, what we got? Um, not what we got. Alright, you know what we got. We got someone that keeps failing. Uh, yep. Screwed. I think gotta be good here. Ooh, it's actually decent. Oh, there's two orange guys now that shoot stuff. No! Yes! Is there three? Yep, there's three. Fantastic. Is there little ones shooting stuff too? Dang. Oh, this game. This little game right here. Alright, nope. The fact that they leave a trail is extremely important now. Gosh. <laughs> I should just like stop playing. It's gonna keep dying. Alright. I know it must be hard all alone in prison, so, but you have you must remain happy. I'm not alone, I have you have the uh the person that put me in here which I wouldn't be very happy uh please please and I have Charlotte and I have Timmy you better stay out under the bed I like to be able to see you right, um you know what guys I feel like it is time for another one of these and hold on Charlotte all right and <laughs> <laughs> I just I don't know why that's just like so nice to look at you know. All right, let's get my Game Boy back up there. I'm just gonna call it a Game Boy. If that's all right with you guys. Uh, it has come to our attention that your happy buddy has shown signs of not behaving in an excited and happy manner. Yeah, that's pretty true. If you wish to have your happy buddy replaced, please send us a letter and we will get rid of him. You don't need to get rid of him. He's doing he's doing his job. And if my happy buddy was Mr. Smiley, I definitely don't want to get rid of him because that'll be messed up. Hello. I heard that some people are reporting their happy buddies to Dr. Money. Who? Dr. Money? What is that? Is he mean like to Dr. Money? Like treat money like really careful or to like somebody named Dr. Money? That'd be weird. It's like that'd be kind of a weird name, you know, Dr. Money. Really kind of hope he gets some more posters and stuff in here that isn't like this. That's just creepy. And that blood just, okay, it's probably not supposed to be blood, but that's what I have a feeling it's supposed to represent. Uh, you know what happens to them, right? Don't you? No, do you? You wouldn't want... You wouldn't do that to me, would you? No, I don't know what happens to them, but I wouldn't do it to you. I'm a nice person. <laughs> also, guys, sorry if I sound a bit hoarse. Uh, I have a bit of a sore throat at the moment. But, you know, recording is recording. You gotta get it done. Sorry about not having a video last Friday, guys, also. I just ran out of time. If you watch it, you know that. <laughs> Okay, I'm sorry I haven't gotten you another game yet. I just don't have the money for it at the moment. It's alright. I like the two games I have. I'll even play it right now. Fear of Fire, I guess. <laughs> Heck no. <laughs> Ugh, I should just stay where I was. I would have lived. Okay, oh, oh, oh. Okay, not a, not a good little... See, ten seconds, like I said, it'll become a lifetime. Okay. Oh my gosh. Oh yes. All right. Cool. I think we're on 16, I believe. I'm so sorry. You don't need to be sorry. You're doing your job. You're keeping me entertained. The game is so very sorry. Oh come on. You're, you're all right. <laughs> all right. Um, fear of fire. Oh, level 17 already. 
There's four of those little orange dudes. Gosh. All right, come on, Timmy. You gotta survive. God, God dang it. Uh, no. I had no idea where to go. It's just so much to keep track of. Difficult. Oh. Yep. I originally thought in my head that those little fireballs wouldn't mean much. Now they definitely are because I've been killed by it three times in a row. Oh, can we do it? I think we got it, guys. Got it. Ah, oh, nice. 18. Friend, is your bug friend keeping you company? Have you given him a name? Yes, his name is Timmy. <laughs> you should. Do you remember how we used to sit by the fireplace carving chess pieces out of wood while out of care in the world? That was a, that was a long time ago. Ooh. Yeah. I don't know, man. I have no idea how old I am. <laughs> uh, my wood carving skills have gotten significantly worse, but I will. I still try to make you something to make you feel less lonely. Ooh, could it be? I don't know. <laughs> it's the leg of a table I'm making for you. I know that might not be the most extravagant project, but I hope you like it anyways. <gasps> Ooh. Ooh. That, that'll look kind of cool. Hopefully, like, it's a legit table. All right, where'd Timmy go? Timmy? Where'd he go? I can't crouch. Can I? Crouch, shift. No, I can't do anything. I have, feel I have a feeling he's probably under the bed. Hopefully. Also, guys, uh, supposedly there's two different endings to this. And I have no idea what, like, a certain part of the game is decides what ending you get. Alright. Um, it's a very, it's a nice evening, isn't it? I hope you have a nice sleep. Aw, oh, thank you, Charlotte. Oh, <gasps> hey, you are, Timmy. Get out of the air. Come on, Timmy. I like you. Don't hide from me. So, today... Oh, so, night time is 6 o'clock. Alright, okay, cool. Oh, Timmy. Why you gotta disappear on me like that, me? Yep, it is 6 o'clock. Okay, gosh. I really hope, like, no one's house gets this pitch black whenever it's still, like, bright like that outside your door or something. This is creepy. Look at that. <laughs> Day 3. Alright, so it is currently 5.15 in the morning, I'm guessing. Oh gosh, that's early. Morning, I have some very good news for you. Is it another game? I'm calling it. It's going to be another game, I hope. Come on. I'm anxious to see what it is. Oh, the second I look away, he gives it to me. i got a new game with a last of my money. This one's a real blast. Have fun. Ooh. What is it? Uh... I'm not, I'm not quite sure how to say that. Uh, Pisces? Moonlight? Pisces? Oh no, it's one of these. It's kind of like an annoying version of Flappy Bird. Oh gosh, yeah. Oh, dang it. Alright. It's weird because I have to hold two keys to move in the right direction. Ooh. Okay, that's gonna get hard. Alright. Don't worry about me spending all my money. I'm okay. I hope so. Um, Minister, can I do anything to this? Press E on it, F maybe? No, it doesn't do anything. Darn. Alright, let's see if I can, uh, play this a little bit more. Kinda looks like a little Timmy with wings, doesn't it? Oh yeah, oh jeez, I cannot imagine what 20 looks like. Uh, just stay happy for me, for the, for the love of all that is holy. Stay happy, they're watching. Okay, don't go all creepy on me like that. They're watching. I had I really have a feeling that like Doctor Money is a person and that he has like some twisted idea of stuff. If that makes any sense. <laughs> Alright. Let's see here. Uh let's try this one more time. Oh yeah. Oh, I, I missed it right at the end. Dang. Alright, that was great. Oh, Alright, here. Let me try if you're a fire again. I like this one. This is so far my favorite one. Ooh, boys. And girl. Do you think we can do this? Nope. <laughs> oh, jeez. Alright, that was a bad place to go. Alright. The world has become such a quiet place. Yeah, it has. I have a table leg. I heard, I haven't heard from Sal in a little while. Hmm. Hopefully he 
sends me a letter soon. Oh, that was weird. My mouse just did something. Uh, let's see what this is. So many people are dying. I watched them choke to death from my pastry shop shop's window. Jeez. Dr. Money has started selling some kind of antidote, but I don't trust him. I wouldn't either. Just especially since his name is Dr. Money. Okay, so Dr. Money is a person. Uh, that's definitely like confirmed now. <clears throat> Alright, let's try Fear of Fire. I wanna. Oh, Alright, well, I didn't mean to do this one. Hello. Oh, okay, that was bad. Alright, hold on. Let's see what this is. From Charlotte again. Charlotte, I mean. Uh, I will not leave my shop. As much as as the loneliness pains me, I need to remain here. But yeah, it's probably, I'm guessing it's like a home's a home, you know? When you feel at home, you feel at home. For me, I guess my home feels like this cell of just gray and gray and uh gray <laughs> and a nice light blue sky outside that's obviously just a picture <laughs> okay uh so we have my hills we've got a clock i'm actually kind of happy there's a clock in here we, we can see what time of day stuff happens uh, we have a really creepy smiley face yeah you're creepy you have nice red eyebrows this is weird all right this is from sal awesome how are you doing um i've been busy carving the second leg for the table oh thank you Maybe eventually put a tabletop on it. I am starting to feel a little homesick. Perhaps it is time to end my journey. <gasps> yes, we have two. Two. Oh, nice. Oh, I see you. I saw you, Timmy. You think you can just be a little sneaky? <laughs> All right. Let's see here. I, I don't. I don't know if it's just me, but like based on the looks of this and how Doctor Money and the antidote and stuff like that sounds already, I have a feeling that I am not in a prison. Cause that is not a prison like door one bit. All right, let's see here. Fear o fire. Oh, fire. Those ten seconds feels like a big eternity. Gosh. Is it? Do they go on like a certain pattern, or is it? I'm guessing it's probably just random each time. Ooh. Got it. Nice. All right. There have been instances of people getting upset about how hard the games for Dr. Money's portable entertainment product are. I don't think I think they're fine. They don't seem very difficult, do they? Like I know that okay, this one this one will be probably decently hard. This one's kinda easy. And then this one is just fun, I think. Oh, ooh, there's only two levels left. This one and the next one. Oh my gosh. Ugh. Alright. Ooh jeez. Ooh jeez. Oh man, I'm just like smash. Feels like sounds like I'm smashing my keyboard. Just like bam, smash. Ugh. Right, 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 right. It's a good spot to be in. Oh dang! No, I saw one. I saw one. It's like a little split second thing. Come on, Tammy, you can't die on me. Oh, it's a bad spot to be in. Dang it! All right. Please do remember. It's not about those games, it's all about happiness. Yeah, I agree completely. I'm feeling happy, pretty happy playing the games. Uh, I'm actually really lucky. Pe people that are in prison definitely don't get like a Game Boy looking thing. With, sorry, I mean the uh, Dr. Money's portable entertainment product. <laughs> you definitely don't get those in prison or anything. You might get TV, but I don't know how often. Alright, let's see here. I want to finish this game. Maybe we get like something special or something, I don't know. Like it just ends and it starts over again. That'd be crazy. Oh no, we weren't supposed to go that way. Oh, sorry, I didn't realize that there was a letter. I found this poster in my attic. I thought it might cheer you up. Then again, it's not very cheerful. Maybe you want it anyway. What is it? Whoa. Yeah, that that isn't very cheerful. It looks kind of cool though. Looks like it is a heart with two ducks kissing in the center. That's what I see anyway. Either that or like a face? Maybe? I'm not quite sure. Dear Blank, <laughs> Dr. Money is taking time off his schedule to, to personally tell you that everything is fine. Hey, the fact that there was like a little line under everything is fine means that it's like just like a film the blank kind of thing. So I definitely think he sent that out to a bunch of different people. Interesting. I definitely see two ducks kissing and a side of a heart. <laughs> and then there's that. <laughs> Try to get, let's try to beat this game, guys. I have a feeling we can do it. What if, what if there's like a boss at the end? It'd be crazy. Oh no. Yep, saw that coming. 
Okay. Wow, this is really wide open over here. Oh, don't say that. Oh, dang. Holy moly. How am I supposed to do this? I'm, I'm gonna let myself die. What happens if I stand still? Oh, nothing. Okay. It just it doesn't pause the game or anything. Okay, I'm, I'm, I'm just gonna stand here. Stand here for a little while. <sighs> Try to, like, stay toward the center. Oh, oh man. I can't, let, me, let myself die so I can get back to the center. Dang it. Oh, this is crazy. Alright. Um, did you get the doctor's message? Yeah, I did. <laughs> I'm increasingly concerned by the way he is ignoring the people's obvious suffering. The antidote he was talking about is the only being sold at a ludicrous price. He does not mean well. Yeah, I have a feeling it's like not an antidote, you know? Fear fire, come on. We got, we've got to finish this game, guys. Oh, no. <sighs> Gosh. It's, just, it's difficult, yes, but it's like one of those games like it's it's the good kind of hard. If that makes sense. Gosh, okay. Friend, the third leg of the table is finished. Huzzah! <laughs> not, not what I was expecting. <laughs> I'm also starting my long journey back to my hometown. I would say I'll probably arrive around tomorrow morning. Looking forward to seeing some familiar faces. He doesn't know about the the virus and stuff that's going on. It's crazy. Ooh. Oh yeah, okay. Stay. Please, just don't go back under the bed. I like you. We good? We good? Okay. I feel like it is time for another one of these guys. How about you? And what are you? Fantastic. It just like slowly falls to the ground. Maybe we could try and cover the floor with that stuff, you know? Tammy, you doing good? I hope so. Alright. Concentration face is on. <laughs> I think I put the wrong face on. Oh, oh, I actually made that through that little gap. Jeez. Oh no, that was a dumb move. I could, I might have just been able to win the game. Dang. Ah. Uh, all right. She's from Charlotte. Hello there, Timmy. <laughs> the face. No, sorry. Uh, the doctor has lowered the price of the antidote. However, it seems to cause various vital organs to fail. Okay, that's not good. People are now not only dying from the virus, but also from the doctor's cure. I'm terrified. Yeah, I will be too. Like I said, it's probably not an antidote. They was like, you know what? This seems like a good color. Maybe we could sell it. There's some dumb stuff that governments and stuff do. Can I just like get you trapped in a corner? No, you just go away. Boop. <laughs> so I bounce around. Boop. Don't you dare go under there. And boop. 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 I do think it's kind of weird how my friend gave me a bug. But, you know, whatever. I guess he has his own little... He has his freedoms. Ah, oh, dang it. Okay. Ah, I didn't see the little one. Alright. Alright, Charlotte, what you got? Most of the cakes have gone bad. I, j I just hope all of this is over soon. I'm not sure how long I can live all alone. I wish I could come visit you. I don't know, man. Prison's a prison. No one really wants to visit a prison. Maybe. I still definitely don't think this is a prison. There's like some big underlining story. Don't don't you dare go out that door. That'll just be mean to me. <laughs> Alright, so we need another leg for the table and then hopefully a tabletop. That'll be cool. Alright. Fear O oh, fire. Oh dang. Oh, gosh. I just like died a lot. Oh, dang. Oh, man. If I could have made that little gap, I might have been able to win. Win, I mean. Oh, jeez. Stay here. Oh, forgot those little fire guys. Make sure you can't just sit still. Hope you're getting these letters. I'm guessing you can't just... I'm guessing you just can't respond. Do letters still get delivered in times like these? Hope so. Are you even still alive? That's a good question. Like, how are they, how are they getting here and... <laughs> am I still alive? <laughs> Friend, this one has given me some problems that the fourth leg is all done now. The last part will be here shortly. Yes. So we are going to get a tabletop. Sweet. Thank you, Sal. You're just really friendly. Alright. Fear o fire. Kind of sound like a... I feel like a pirate saying that. God dang it. Fear o fire. <laughs> I don't know why either. 
Ah, this is difficult. It's the last level. What do you expect? Oh my god. Okay, that was a tight space to get into. Come on. Uh, come on. Oh. oh. Alright, let's try this. I was about to die anyway. You okay? Apparently more and more enemies are killing themselves. Please, do not, please don't do that for your sake and mine. I feel, I'm feeling alright, buddy. Don't worry. It's almost night time. I can almost go to bed again. can't take that away from me. My dear friend, uh, my good night. Oh, sorry. My good night present to you will be the tabletop. Now you finally have something to put in your on in your cell. Put oh sorry. <laughs> I'm just, I'm just going to start this over. My good night present to you will be the tabletop. Now you finally have something to put stuff on in your cell. I don't have anything to put on. But you know, whatever. <laughs> I hope you actually have stuff to put on it. Yeah. That'd be nice. All right. Let's do one more little round. Can I not? Oh, I actually have to go to bed. Darn. Day four. All right. What we got? My journey has come to an end. As you know, I do not, I do not have a family to come home to. But that's not what matters to me. I'm just looking forward to smell, to the smell of my hometown. I have a feeling you're gonna be finding the smell of dead bodies. That's pretty cool. Look at that. It's all nifty. All right. To beat this level, guys. Okay, let's beat this level. Dies really fast. Oh man. Ooh man, this game is difficult. Gosh. Okay, okay I did not press that game. Man, this is just difficult. I want to beat this really bad too. All right. Uh, where is everyone? Oh no, he found out. <laughs> oh man, he's like in shock right now. I have a feeling. Ah, dang. This game, I swear. Alright. Oh, this is my happy buddy. Morning. Sold my house and my food and one of my lungs, but don't worry. Okay, dude, you should not do that. I spent the money on another game for you. Yay. Have fun. Be happy. Are you serious? What is it? Triangle Wars. What is it? Oh, it's, it's like uh, the Impossible Game and uh, Geometry Dash. Okay, the physics are kind of weird. Is that really all the first level was? Oh, okay, well, there is 20. Oh, now they're taller. Oh, yes. I love games like this, guys. Okay, so you can't duck. I just kind of pressed it to see if that would work. Oh, dang, son. We are... Aw, oh, never mind. Get. Oh, it's from Charlotte again. The streets used to be so lively, and now they're just silent. Yeah. I honestly don't remember what streets look like. I've been living in the cell for too long. Three days. No, four days. Wait. Three or four. I lost count already. Jeez. Alright, let's do a little bit more Triangle Wars. Alright, that was just like the same button thing over and over again. Oh. What? Oh! I can break it. Interesting. Oh, huh. Like mentally you think this to go over it, you know? Oh yes. Alright. Uh, I have I have this old gramophone in my basement. Perhaps it will break the silence. <gasps> That'd be cool. Music is music, you know? Music is always awesome anyway. Unless you, I don't know, you listen like some kind of recording or whatever, someone talking or whatever, I don't know. People have their own like, things that they like to hear. 
All right, what time is it? It's currently 8 o'clock. Right? Yeah. Really? But we go to sleep at 6. Jeez, okay. I'm guessing we're waking up earlier and earlier, day by day, I'm guessing. I don't know. Alright, let's do this, guys. <laughs> That's not how you do it, guys. <laughs> Ah, oh, dang it. Alright. Um, do you know what's going on here? The virus, the organs, the blood? Yeah, I do. Fortunately, I do. Timmy. Hmm. How many more of these do we have? We have two little uh, the kazoo things. Or whatever they're called. They're not called kazoo. But and stuff. <clears throat> Mistakes were made. I, Dr. Money, want to personally apologize for any inconveniences that has arisen from the virus of our creation. Okay, good job, genius. You created a virus that killed everybody, almost. Please accept this random picture of Money as consolation. What? Oh, okay. Okay, it's not frames, first off. Money survives all hardship. That's a lie. That kind of looks like the uh, Eye of Endear from Minecraft. <laughs> Uh, people are dying. Their organs are failing because of an antidote from the virus. From for the virus. And everyone is infected. I wonder if I am too. I have a feeling you ought to be alright. Who knows, man? Alright, let's try Triangle Wars and we'll do some more. Try and beat Fear of Fire. Alright, cool. Right. Gotta beat this Fear of Fire, man. Maybe not. Maybe not. Let's see what this is. From Sal again. Sweet. There seems to be a huge market for working organs now. Dr. Money has a big supply and everyone is rushing to the stores and spending all their money. Well, but those organs are not what they seem. Yeah, if you like some big supply of organs, I have a feeling that they're either synthetic. Wait, synthetic? No, sorry. <laughs> uh, artificial or not human organs. I don't know, man. The government and stuff in real life do some weird does some weird things. Oh, could this be the one? This is it. I got it. Congratulations for completing this game. A valuable badge has been placed in your in your vicinity. My vicinity? Oh, that's cool. Oh, that's awesome. <laughs> Alright, um... Anyone who uses the doctor's organs dies a couple of hours later. Where do they come from? What are they? Does it even matter anymore? Are you infected too, friend? No, I think I'm alright. I'm just... <laughs> That's pretty cool. That's a little cool thing. I bet the game developers are like, you know what? We should, we should give them some kind of reward for winning. Alright, so... For your fire, I finished that. Uh, Peaceous... I don't know how to say that, guys. Sun, Moonlight, uh, and Triangle Wars. Let's see if we can finish Triangle Wars. Yes, alright. Alright, we got another letter. Um, how much of the outside world can you hear in this cell? I have no idea. How high are you up, even? Even up, sorry. Um, I guess I can't know. Just listen closely. <gasps> Ooh, we got, like, French music here. <laughs> That's so stereotypical. This looks cool. If I can just, like, sit in Paris or something, who knows? City of love. That's cool, I like this honestly, even though it's not like my choice of music, it sounds pretty cool. I feel like it deserves one of these whenever it gets over. That was cool. Wait. Ta -da! Thank you, Charlotte. That was cool. Yes, it was Charlotte. <laughs> awesome. Okay, let me get my Game Boy. Alright, there we go. Could you hear from up there? I turned it up extra loud for you. There's no better times than these for a little music. And yet, I feel lonely. Aw, oh, man, I wish I could be out there with you, you know? The floor is covered in confetti. There's the word. Confetti. <laughs> from Charlotte again. Of course, I could play the music again, but is it worth it? I won't, it will never... It will never be the same magical moment again. I don't know, man. Music can be pretty awesome. That one moment in between all the dreary ones. Yeah. 
<laughs> I don't know about you guys, but I love listening to music, and I have a feeling most most of you guys probably do too. It's also one of the reasons I posted the that royalty free dubstep stuff. It's cool, and it's easy for YouTubers to get music that they uh, won't get copyright strikes on. This can't go on forever. Yes, it can. Hopefully one day whenever I get out of the cell or maybe you can find wherever the heck I am, hopefully we can have a good time. Whenever she says I hope this doesn't go on forever or this can't go on forever, I hope she doesn't mean what I'm thinking. My room is looking pretty complete. I have a feeling hopefully maybe something will go there and I'll get something to put on the table. Alright, let's try to finish the uh, Triangle War. So I, I love games like this. I like Geometry Dash and stuff too. Never play the impossible game though, even though it's the original, supposedly. I kinda forgot you could go down for a second. <laughs> oh yeah. Alright. Um I don't even know how many people are dead. I'm afraid to look. I can only see what's outside my window, and I see nothing but blood. I think I am alone. You're not alone, I'm here. Everyone is dead. No, me. <laughs> yeah, me is alive. I'm alive, you're alive, and Salvador is hopefully alive. The city's lights are going out, really? The town has no electricity anymore. The only lights I see are coming from the prison. <gasps> you should come here to the prison with me. That'd be cool. So she can see the prison, so that means we live close to each other. Or, we are close to each other, by the way. Alright. Uh, Triangle Wars, guys. Oh yeah. Alright. One more day. One more day for what? What does that mean? You just can't say one more day. What does that mean? Just one more day? I don't know, guys. Some kind of sketchy, I guess you could say. Um, tomorrow evening, what are you talking about? I don't know. Hopefully it's nothing bad. Uh, until then, you must come here. I can't leave. Uh, I will wait here. Okay, I will try and get to you the best I can, I guess. I don't know how the heck I'm going to get to her. I don't even know where she is. Hmm. I don't know, man. Just the way she just like said, one more day. Tomorrow evening. If you can't make it, well, I fear this world has no place for me anymore. No. I know I... I know what she's thinking about doing. She just shouldn't do that. I don't know. I guess we can play some more Triangle Wars then. Oh wow, this one's fast. Okay. Gosh, okay. Oh yeah, alright. Um, I'm awaiting your revel. Until then, here's the cake I made for you. <gasps> yes, the stuff to go on my table. <laughs> Thank you. Can I eat it? Uh oh I can. Okay. I don't I don't want to eat all of it. Hope you like it. It tasted really good, that little piece I took out of it. Did you hear about did you hear the wonderful music? I tried to head in its direction, but it was over too quickly. I am so tired. I will just go sleep in some empty apartment around here. God knows there are enough of those now. Yeah. I need to see you again, friend. Hopefully we can. Maybe you can get me out of here. Ooh, that'd be cool. Uh, I'm not going to eat the piece of cake yet, guys. Alright. Triangle Wars is. Maybe not. <laughs> well, you're probably still in that cell all alone. Tomorrow I'll come visit you. But first, let us rest, friend. Oh, yep. It is getting close it's that time again isn't it buddy are you playing your games I haven't talked to you in a while uh, are you happy I am pretty happy I'm feeling alright for there being a virus apocalypse and a cell here alright so this time it isn't going to bed at 6 o'clock it's going to bed at 6 30 I'm guessing maybe 
Oh no. I'm happy but tired. Sleepy buddy, sleep. No, sorry, sleep buddy, sleep. Alright, so it does that it does actually go at six, it's just that's just where it was, I'm guessing. Tomorrow it will all end. I don't see man, I don't know how I feel about that. Tomorrow it will all end. I think it'll be day five tomorrow. It's, it's kind of creepy, man. Let's go to bed. Yep, day five. Okay, so it was day four. Jeez, it's been four days? Well, okay. It has been like 50-something minutes almost. <gasps> Happy buddy. Good morning, good morning. No, goody, goody, goody morning. Are you all good, all fine? I don't care. Oh, come on. You changed text. I'm not your friend. I was never your friend. Dr. Money was blackmailing me. He, kid my, he kidnapped my dollars, daughters. He told me that they were safe. He told me that they would be okay as long as I kept you happy. But he lied. My daughters are dead. Uh, they died from the virus two days ago. I never got to say, to be, say goodbye. See, that's, that's screwed up, man. This is really messed up. But to you, I will. You're going to say goodbye to me? Or are you going to get another one? You cannot lose hope. As I have now. I have another game for you. What is it? I'm curious to know what the game is. I don't have the money for such expen expensive, but there's a huge market for organs now. I have a feeling he's going to sell his organs and give me a game and then die. I already sold one of my lungs yesterday, and now I'll finish what I have started. I signed... I signed for them to take all of my organs, money up front. Jeez. This guy's like dedicated. I will not survive the procedure, of course, but that's not important. Yeah, it is. You're gonna die. That's important. You're one of the only ones left who are still healthy. Please do not lose hope. I'm not. I'm not gonna lose hope. Hopefully, my butt style will come get me. Hope you enjoy the game. Okay. I doubt it because it isn't fun, like seriously, not at all. Keep checking it, sorry. Hope you keep going anyway. Anyway, always keep going, don't give up like me. You never know how much more time you have. Okay, we'll look at the game just a sec, guys. Goodbye. No, happy buddy, why? I did the leave. Oh man, what's the game? Uh, Crankmaster, okay. What? Wait, is this really all it is? I just... Turn it? There's 20 levels of that? That is so dumb. Why is... This guy literally is like going insane. Hmm, okay, well, we'll finish this little one, I guess. Is, is that really all it is? Oh, okay. Interesting. <laughs> It has come to our attention that your happy buddy has stopped talking to you. We would like to remind you that you are loved and that you must remain happy. I think you're lying to me, Mr. Dr. Money. I'm not, I'm not playing Crank Master. That game is stupid. Oh my gosh, this is fast. Oh, what? There we go, we beat it. Nice. Alright. Okay. You're worth every penny. Great. Alright, let's see if we can finish this right here. Oh, 
There we go. Oh, damn. Press the wrong button. is dead. There's no life left in it. I'm walking through these streets all alone. I'm on my way. Cool. Hopefully you make it here. I, ho I really hope that Sal isn't infected or anything. That'll just suck. In the meantime, let's play some more Triangle Wars. Okay, come on, I pressed down. Ah, oh, gosh, man, that's fast. I think I'm close to your prison. I'm really looking forward to seeing you again. You belong in that cell. You being in that cell all this time, still must be alive, right? Yep, I'm pretty sure I'm alive. Um, where did Timmy go? Interesting, okay. Could have, I have no idea where he is. I have a feeling he's just under the bed again. Uh, my floor is nice and colorful. <laughs> Alright. Is there be anybody else talking to me? They tend to be, like, uh, be synced up with the clock. So maybe at, uh... Nope. Alright, so no one yet. I'm guessing it'll probably be in 15 minutes in-game. Might be running to a dead man. The thought of that is kind of scary. Yeah, it is. <laughs> I will not give up though. A little virus won't kill you now, will it? I don't think it will. Unless, you know, it actually gets here. I think I'm doing fine. Hopefully, get some more messages from him. Man, come on. I want to see some. I want to talk to my buddy Sal so I can meet him, hopefully. that one jump. Alright, let's see here. Uh, we finished this, right? Yep. Alright. Let's do... Oh, let's, let's actually read the letter from Dr. Money. Listen, we have noticed that you are being contacted by someone with a miserably free spirit. <clears throat> we would like you to ignore him, ignore all of his letters from now on. No way, he's my bud. Why would I do that? When he survives all hardship, got a smiley face, a heart with two ducks cussing, kissing in it. <laughs> Not cussing. Uh, the hills from windows. Wow, a lot of stuff has been added. I really just started with, I originally started with a bed and a clock. That's pretty cool. Bang. I don't know why, every once in a while that, that little like duck just gets me. Ugh. You're being taken care of. You're being protected from the virus and the horrors of the outside world. Do not forget, you are now, I'm sorry, you are a prisoner after all. Man, that's true. I am a prisoner. I don't know, man. I really don't feel like I am, especially because he just told me that I am, you know? Oops. My fault. Ah, my 
my brain can't keep up. That little jump right there, is, it's, been, it's got me so many times. Alright, I think I can see your prison from here. Maybe one or two hours now. I can't wait, and once I'm there, I will release you from prison. Okay. You cannot see one or two hours. Well, okay, if you're walking, maybe. I don't know, that's a ways. So one or two hours, so it'll be around five? This friend here is Salvador. He cannot he cannot be here. I do not appreciate the way he talks. I do not appreciate the way he's talking about freedom to you. All right. This is no joke. Cease all contact with this Salvador. Okay, I'm going to take it as a joke because, you know, he's my bud. Uh, I just kind of realized I'm not getting any messages from Charlotte. Hmm. I don't know. I've arrived. Where's your cell? Where are these letters being sent to? I can cannot seem to enter the building. All the doors are locked. Hmm. I don't know, man. Oh, here we go. Come on. I broke in, but the elevator won't come, and there are no stairs. It seems that I have no way of getting to however high up you are. There must be an easy way. I'd assume so. If the elevator is broken and there's no stairs. It's getting late, friend. Maybe I don't have to get up there. Maybe. Maybe. <laughs> maybe. Maybe you could come down here. I don't know. I can't get out of the cell. There's wires here for something, I'm guessing. You know this building you are in was never supposed to be a prison. There are no cells on the bottom floor. And looking at the plans, there were no cells here anyway. I knew it. I knew that door was definitely a reason why. Because that's not a prison or like a jail door. Dr. Money must be must have repurposed the building for locking you up. But why would he do that? It seems so arbitrary. Yeah? This is kind of weird, man. I definitely am not in a prison now. Uh, but no matter what's, what matters is that the, the lock on your cell is powered by electricity, which means that if I manage to destroy the prisoner's the prison's generator, you will be free to leave. <gasps> Ooh, yes, please do that. Me eat piece of cake. Um. All right, are you coming? I will be soon. I promise. Hopefully, anyway. Please tell me that you'll come. I will. I promise. It is 520. Sorry, 535. I'm so lonely. I bet you are. I am too. Kind of. <laughs> I'm sorry, friend. Wait. Am I going to get another message from her? I'm sorry. No! I think she just like shot herself or something. See guys, I told you. Like, this is probably a reason why it said that in the description of the game. Man, did she really just do that? <sighs> Great. My buddy Sal needs to hurry up. Here we go. Alright. I found the generator. Friend, friend, I only need to destroy this and you'll be free. Go right ahead. That'd be nice. Come find me at the entrance, friend. I'm looking forward to shaking your hand once more. Something gonna happen? Oh, yep, something's happening. Oh, that's creepy. Whoa. Oh, yes. Can I? Oh, yeah, oh. Your friend has tried to destroy the generator. That didn't really work out, too. Well, for him, for him, did it? He got electrocuted. Your friend is dead. What? No, I have nobody friends with. They all are. Now your cell door may be open. But what do you think leaving will accomplish? This, this town is dead. You and I are the last ones here. The backup generators only has an energy for those red lights, so the door is unlocked now. 
Just stay in your cell. No, I'm not going to stay in my cell. I will send someone to fix the generator for you. You'll be able to keep playing games on your portable electronic entertainment product. Sorry. Without a care in the world. I will even tell you why you are here. We'll never know that if you leave. I'm here because you planned this virus and crap, didn't you? You'll be allowed to do whatever you wish, uh-huh. On one condition. Do not le open that door. Oh, what? <gasps> I don't know. I'm doing it. Screw it. I'm going out. Okay. Hold on. I'm, I'm going to eat a piece of cake. This is creepy. Can I open any of the doors? Is it E? No? Something over here. What is this? What is that? Oh! It's... It's a, like a wire piece. Wow. Okay, it is dark outside. It's a piece of that thing on my door. Can I put it here? For space to install every elevator button. Yes. Oh, click, I clicked down. Where are we going? Oh, so this is the elevator that wasn't working. Okay, wow, we are going down. A long way is really fast. Holy crap. Oh my gosh, it's so quick. Is it gonna slow down? creepy in here now, man. That looks all, like, black and stuff. Whoa. Okay. So this was the elevator. Timmy, you wanna come with me? No? Come here. I, I, I see you. Come on. It's the door to the outside, I think. Let me, let me try this in real fast. No, it doesn't open. Press space to leave the building. Don't mind if I do. Whoa. Is this Charlotte's shop? Yeah, Charlotte's delicious pastry. Oh, there's blood inside. Can I, can I go in? I don't know if I want to. There's space to open the door. This is weird. Candle and a letter. Wait, what? Is that the end of the game? To my only friend. When you're reading this, I already have. I will already be dead. My shop will probably look quite messy. I have decided that I'll go to the back room to die, so you don't have to look at my corpse. I'm sorry I couldn't be more patient and waiting for you. But that doesn't matter now. What matters is that you're here. Against all odds, you managed to escape the prison. 
I'm aware that this may seem like a bad ending to the story, but you're here. You're here, and I have baked another cake for you. I'm not sure how fresh it will be when you fin when you find this. As for all I know, you never will, but I hope you enjoy it anyway. I wish you the best of luck. Charlotte. Is this the end of the game? The next morning. Charlotte's Delicious Pastries. Yep, there's myself. Oh, is Timmy still in there? Yes, Timmy. What? That's the end? How? Oh my gosh. How? Oh my gosh. I really wish there was more of the game to that. Dang. I, I honestly have no idea how to take this game. That's definitely not what I was expecting to happen at all. Hmm. I don't know guys, if you have like any thoughts on what, like how you see the game, you can leave them down below, but how I saw it was just that, <laughs> things happen. <laughs> ah man. Anyway, uh, so yeah, this game was called uh, Presentable Liberty. It's a free game, you can just like probably type it in on the internet, type in download, and it'll be there somewhere. Man, this is... This game was awesome for being a free game. Thank, thank you to whoever made this game, even though you're probably not watching this. Okay. Anyway, uh, I would like to thank you guys so much for watching this. Um, my name is Wally Jack. Thank you so much for watching this, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Goodbye. <laughs>